Welcome to Mocklin Manor. This is what they call the stair room. It's the great hall as you come into the house. The craftsmanship is unbelievable. The house was built in 1916. We have pictures of the house that were taken for Architectural Forum, which is now Architectural Digest from 1919. And this table was in those photographs. Uh, we learned from one of the great grandchildren that this and a mantle that's in the living room were from a monastery in England. We believe after having experts look at it that they're anywhere from 400 to 500 years old. As we go up the staircase, uh, you can see the woodwork continues, hand-carved arrangements that depict artichokes. And artichokes are known as, as bringing peace and longevity. Here they hung a tapestry that now hangs in the National Cathedral in Washington, D.C. So coming back here, we entered sort of the servants' quarters or the staff quarters. That was a common bathroom. We have the dumb waiter, and over here was a freight elevator. Every room had a sink, so you can envision that a maid stayed here, and then the nun stayed here, so this is one bedroom. This is someplace we're modernizing the kitchen. All the tile was covered in six or seven layers of paint that we had to scrape and peel off. Another interesting thing is this had four different layers of flooring. There was three quarters of inch cork flooring, then it had a tile on top of that, then it had linoleum. We're gonna do a checkerboard cork flooring to actually restore it back to the original floor. We'll look at the dining room. So you can imagine the staff bringing out things for the family. All the lighting was original to the house. This mantle we know came out of the Cornell Hotel in Philadelphia. Frank Gifford Talman, the builder of the house, uh, paid $190 for it. So we're entering the library. This is one room that we actually have somewhat completed. Just as Frank Talman wrote to Wilson Eyre, the architect, I need upper shelves because we have a great number of books to store. This is one of our favorite rooms of the house. We look forward to reading classics to our grandchildren and sitting in here for hours just relaxing. Thank you so much for taking the interest in the property. It's been great to work with Bravo Roof Tile to restore the roof and to save this house for the next generation and restore it to its former glory. We hope to do this house justice and we're just stewards of the house. It'll be here for the next generation.